So here we are catalyzing the seaweed revolution for the benefits of the local communities and the benefits of the ocean. My name is Noreen Mwancha. I am one of the co-founders of Rethread Africa based in Nairobi. Rethread Africa was formed in response to the plastic crisis that affects Africa much more than we can imagine. You see, the world is producing more clothes than ever before, driven by cheap plastic fibers like polyester, which not only end up in our landfills, but even more concerningly, in our bodies as microplastics. At Rethread Africa, we upcycle agricultural waste into a 100% bio-based material that serves to be a replacement to plastic-based synthetics. During this photo shoot, we were able to creatively connect the problem with its solution. But we struggle to find the perfect harmony between our outfit and the heaps of textile waste lying around. This serves to be a stark reminder that one has to go for the other to thrive. I think that Africa is headed in the right direction, and I would like to encourage communities businesses and youth to focus on creating solutions that not only address current challenges, but also align with Africa's unique strengths. My name is Joyce Kamande. I'm a co-founder and the chief operations officer in Safi Organics. We grew up in the rural areas and so we have been witnessing first hand hunger issues due to declined yields due to infertile soils. For a farmer, they can only afford the cheapest synthetic fertilizers that in the long run have degraded and acidifies their soils. Our solution is that uh, we are disrupting the fertilizer value chain, and especially in Africa. We leverage on technology, hardware and software to decentralize and small-scale fertilizer production in blade-based units using the locally available resources, labor and waste. Seeing the lives of water farmers transform. It brings us the joy. We have the power to change the story. We are fortunate to be living during the era where we really contributed to that change so that our future can actually look more bright. My name is Gabrielle Osinga. I'm a chemical engineer by background. TH4 basically is a company um, service provider that aim to produce biofuel based on seaweed, on algae. So we extract the gas and then we liquefy, so we compress at negative temperature, so it becomes liquid and then you have your biofuel. This green project is amazing and it would be awesome if we can actually get all the communities involved as much as we can. Seaweed has great potential, like it's a booming in the city coming up, it's like carbon captures can be used for nutrition, human consumption. We can use it as fertilizer, we can use it to make gas. I want my work to be meaningful in the next 20, 30, 50 years from now. My name is Annalie Murray. I'm Chief Operating Officer at Plantify. We are in South Africa definitely facing increasing electricity costs year on year and so trying to figure out how to make the most out of the energy we have is really an economic problem and I think similarly we know uh, climate change in the long term will have a big economic uh, impact on uh, developing countries in particular. I think this is very topical for um, consumers who invested in solar uh, outlays or inverters and solar panels in the last year or so. Um, making small changes can really help you get a lot more out of those systems uh, and reduce your reliance on the grid. So little differences, but big impact overall. A lot of people don't really appreciate how 
electricity grid is uh, so interconnected. At the end of the day, we share this resource and we can actually help uh, transition it into a, a much more cleaner and resilient version of itself. We're all in this together. I think figuring out how to make small changes uh, to make the big difference overall uh, is really key to everyone in our community. So when I'm banking, 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 I'